I have the best kitchen items to share with you today. Now, these aren't items that I just bought and said, oh, I'm gonna make a video about these. I have been using these items for years. I love them all, and I think you're really gonna love them too. I'll be going through each item. I'm gonna put the number down below and then kind of list it for you in case you wanna check any of them out. That'll make it easier for you. But let's get started with number one. Okay, so my first item is this mini colander. So the thing I love about it is it's like, flat and then all you have to do is you pop out the bottom or you can see kind of popped out it fits all kinds of things you know if you want to just like make a small portion of fruit or you're just making a small amount of pasta just for yourself what i love the best is that it can be like pushed down flat and stored away i also have the bigger one which i bought i can show it to you here i don't like this one as much but it's the same idea you know you store it flat and then you pop out the bottom and you can see it's it's bigger the thing that's cool about this one is you can pull out the sides and then put it on your sink so when you're making pasta you know you just stick it on your sink pour the pasta in and it works really well and it's it's big but you know it can store pretty small so i do like that about it i don't use it as much i do use the little one a lot though okay my second item is this white storage tray that i'm going to show you so it's just this little storage tray. You can get it on Amazon. I'm sure they have it at other places, but I just use it in all of my cabinets and it keeps things kind of organized. I used to have all of these vitamins just sitting in the cabinet, but now I put them all in this tray and then I just pull them out and I can see what I need and easily, it just keeps everything contained. You could probably also use it in the bathroom, wherever you want, but I like to use these in the kitchen a lot. Next item is this olive oil pourer. It has like almost a cult following on Amazon. We just randomly bought it because we didn't like to have our olive oil sitting out on the counter, but essentially it's just this nice container it's darker because you need to store olive oil in a darker container so it doesn't go bad it comes with two of these removable tops and then it also comes with two of these little funnels so that you can fill it really easily but it's just it looks nice on the counter and we've been using it for years we actually broke one and we rebought it but it's just a great thing to have and olive oil is really healthy you just can use it on all of your salads and whatever else you want to put it into okay my number four item is this little silverware tray so you can kind of see it here. I'll actually take the things out so you can see it a little bit better. But this is the tray and I just put it in my silverware drawer. Essentially what I do is I've got my all of my silverware in a silverware container and then I have two of these next to it. I can show you. It's just really convenient because it fits, they fit things perfectly. Like this one, it fits the can opener really well and then I also put the peeler next to it and it just keeps things like nice and contained in the drawer and these organizers just really keep everything together contained and looking nice. Okay this next item is the Sil Pat silicone baking tray. So let me just show you. This is what it looks like. So it's not the whole tray. It's just the topper here and it's just like a baking mat. If you're still using foil on your cookie sheets or your cookie trays I highly encourage you to stop doing that and get these mats. These are amazing. You can bake anything and everything on top of them. They supposedly last forever. Like the manufacturer said you can use them for 20 years or more. They, they do get like a little darker because of the heat, but they're oven safe up to like 500 degrees. When I make cookies on them, they the cookie bottoms do not burn in any way. So I highly recommend these mats. I think they're amazing. I learned about them from the Food Network like 20 years ago and I still use them to this day. Okay, my next item are these metal straws. So I bought these for the kids because my kids like to drink milk with straws. I think they miss their sippy cups, but the straws are have been great. They're made of stainless steel and these are like the larger size straws if you can see they're not so tiny and we've they were purple you know the color has kind of faded because I do put them in the dishwasher but it's it's been so much better to have these than to have to buy the plastic straws or even the paper straws these work really well the kids like them when they're done I just run them through the dishwasher and it's perfect okay this next one is genius I love it I this is a cabinet organizer for your like saran wraps and tin foils and other things that you may need it just attaches right under onto the shelf and you can quickly and easily see everything you need they're also renter friendly because they're just stuck on with sticky sort of like command strips but i highly recommend this okay this next one is the silicone donut tray 
I, I didn't know I needed this until I bought it, but you can make your own homemade donuts. They're obviously not the fried ones. These are just baked. So you just make your donut batter, uh, you stick it in these trays, and then you bake it. I love these trays because they're, because they're silicone, they're like very flexible. I can just like push them into the pantry in like strange places so that they fit. You know, you can, I roll them up and store them so they just hardly take up any space. And I have to say, the kids love the donuts so much. They ask me to make them all the time. There's tons of recipes online, but the donut trays, your donuts will come out looking professional and amazing, and I highly recommend these donut trays. All right, moving along, now I'm gonna talk about the bambooey paper towels. So I saw this, I'm just gonna show you kind of like what they look like. They, they, okay, I saw this on Shark Tank, and basically the idea is these are these like reusable paper towels that's, that are made of bamboo, and you kind of use them anywhere that you would use a paper towel, and then you just throw it in the washing machine when you're done. So I just have this little container under the sink that's full of them, and you know, when they start to get really old, I'll buy another roll of the bambooies. I've only ever had to buy two rolls, and I've been using them for about at least five years now. But here's kind of what they look like. I've used these many, many times. They, any place that you would use a paper towel is where you can use one of these these bambooies. But this is what they look like, like cloth. But like I said, they don't last forever. They do get holes in them, but then you can just buy another container of them. You can throw out the ones that you don't need. But this has helped me save so many paper towels. At this point, we're probably going through maybe four rolls of paper towels a year, I would say. So these are saving us a ton of paper towels, a ton of waste, a ton of money. Paper towels are expensive. These are not expensive. So I highly recommend these. Okay, my next item are these dispensers. So you can put soap in here. I have these right next to our kitchen sink and I have a uh, hand soap in one and then dish soap in the other. If you're trying to make your kitchen look a little bit less cluttered, one of my recommendations and tips is that you actually use these type of soap dispensers instead of displaying the, the store-bought soap dispensers. A lot of times when you're looking around a kitchen you see different colors and shapes that kind of looks cluttered to your eye, but then if you get these soap dispensers that are a little bit sleeker and consistent looking, and you just have these on the counter instead, it looks a lot less cluttered. Okay, my next item is this Yeti tumbler. So this I actually bought for my husband for his birthday last year. He loves it, he uses it every day. Even though we work from home, he uses it at home. You know, he puts coffee in it, he could take the kids to school in the morning, bring the coffee with him, Sometimes he'll just drink the coffee in it at home instead of using a regular mug. The key is that it keeps the coffee really hot, so it, so that's great. The other thing is you can also put cold drinks in it and it will keep your drinks cold. What we also really like about it is, is it doesn't have like a ton of like complicated, there's some coffee in here still, but it doesn't have a ton of complicated parts on the top, so it's really easy to wash and keep clean. You can run it through the dishwasher. It is made of stainless steel, but then it comes in a ton of different colors. Okay, my next recommendation is this silicone sponge holder. So I have these right on the sink, and I keep our sponge just sitting right in it. I actually have two. I keep the sponge in one, and then I keep these in the other. I think that it, these just like kind of, again, keep the sponge corralled, they keep the soap corralled. And the other thing that they do is they prevent the water, if you have like water on your sponge or water on your soap dispensers, they kind of save your countertops. So I no longer have like a ring on my countertop from the bottom of the soap dispenser, it just sits in here. The thing I love about these, is not only do they look nice, but they can also just be tossed in the dishwasher and they come out looking clean, fresh, and new. So I highly recommend these. Okay, this next item is something you never knew you needed, but it is these bamboo toaster tongs. My husband used to, if you can believe this, actually stick like a fork in the toaster to get his bread out. And my mom was quite horrified when she saw this, as we all were. So she ended up buying these and they they just get so much use. Literally, we use them many times a day. The thing that's great about these is they're they're really small, but they like fit into any toaster. You know, you can see that they're nice and thin, but the best part is they're magnetic. And so we have ours just attached on the side of our refrigerator, which is right next to our toaster. You can also attach these to your toaster. A lot of toasters are magnetic as well. So it's super convenient, easy to get your toast out with these. Okay, this next item is kind of like a two-in-one, but it's all about OXO products. 
I think these are amazing products. The first one I have is this cheese grater here. Works so well. If you're anything like me, I had my cheese grater for probably like close to 20 years and it was a real struggle to shred my cheese. And of course, I'm like shredding more and more cheese these days and I just finally became so fed up. I found this OXO grater. It's amazing. It shreds so quickly. You just take your block, shred it, you're done in seconds. So it's sharp and very sturdy. And also for OXO are these fish turners, which sounds weird, but I have to tell you, we have like three or four of these. That's how often we use them throughout the day. So we just cook things. We, we have like stainless steel pots and pans and we use this in there. We use it for eggs. I also like to use it to get cookies off the cookie tray. I like to use it for being pancakes. It has so many uses, but I highly recommend these. You know, like I said, we've got a number of them and we just use them constantly. This next item is this bread box. I love it so much. We use it every day. You can put all kinds of things in it. It's actually like a really decent size inside. It also comes in a lot of colors and it's just really helped to keep the kitchen, you know, keep the bread and everything corralled and in one place and it looks nice sitting there on your counter. Okay, my next item are these ramekins. So, First of all, I bought these a couple of years ago for Thanksgiving and I thought, okay, well, I'm gonna make like some sort of creme brulee or something for Thanksgiving dinner and, and I'll use these. I thought they were like so pretty with all of the vivid, bright colors. I actually keep them in the package that they came in. Just, you know, I have them right in my pantry and I know that they're all together and I don't lose them and I don't break them, but these are amazing. These are oven safe, microwave safe, dishwasher safe. They look pretty. I use them for so many things, not just desserts. The kids use them. You can even put snacks in them. When I wanna make like, a, the kids have like recipes for like mug cakes and things like that, they can use these. If you have like leftover batter and you, and you wanna just bake it, but it's a tiny amount, you can put it in here and just bake it right alongside your cake. These have so many uses just because they're, you know, can go in the oven and everything. So I highly recommend these. I use them all the time. My next item is this egg organizer and I will link it. So this just sits right in your fridge and as you can see, just has the top and all of the eggs go in it. This is so convenient. I just really hate the look of the egg cartons that you get in the store. I think this looks so much nicer and this kind of holds a ton of eggs. And if I have like, if I've bought a lot of eggs, cause we do go through a lot of eggs in this house, sometimes I just put the, the bottom of it underneath and then I sort of pile the eggs up here. I stick them in the fridge and it just keeps the eggs together. They don't break and it just looks a lot nicer in the fridge. Okay, my last item is this Braun Immersion Blender. I also use this so much. And this blender is many, many, many years old. It is still going strong. I use it for all kinds of soups, stews, sauces. The, the thing I love about this is you just plug it in, you stick it in your pot of whatever you're making, and if you wanna blend your soup, you just turn it on and you can do the whole pot in just like less than a minute. If you've ever seen like different recipes, they say like transfer to a blender and then put it back. I mean, who wants to be messing around with that? This immersion blender is so much better. Okay, next is this microwave cover. This is another find from my mom. But basically, you can kind of see here, it just goes right over your food when you're cooking it in the microwave. It's super simple to use. I love it too because it's dishwasher safe, so when it does start to get kind of splatters on it, you can throw it in the dishwasher. It definitely just like protects the inside of your microwave from getting dirty. But the other thing it does, which I kind of like, is it keeps your food almost like a little hydrated. So if you're heating up something, that gets like dry as it's getting hot. This actually keeps the steam in and I find that the food when it's heated in the microwave isn't as dry when I use this microwave cover. Okay, my last product is this Pyrex baking dish with the cover. So these come in all kinds of different sizes. This is the smaller one, but the thing that's great about this is the cover. So I have used Pyrex dishes for you know a very long time and I just didn't even know that they had covers, but they do. And I have to say, these covers are genius. So anytime I make something and you know I make a big portion, we don't finish it, I just stick the cover on and stick it right in the fridge. It's perfect for leftovers. It's also great if you need to transport it and take it anywhere. It's really easy to just like 
snap the lid on and take the container wherever you go. Pretty well sealed, nothing comes out, but I really love these. And you can also buy the covers separately if you already have the containers, which chances are you probably do. But if you don't, I highly recommend the glass baking dishes and the covers. And that does it, those are my top kitchen items. I really think that you should give some of these a try if you don't have them already. I would also love to hear from you what are your top kitchen items because I'm always on the lookout for things that are gonna make my life easier, especially in the kitchen. I hope you enjoyed this video. I would love if you would subscribe and maybe give it a thumbs up if you liked the content and I will see you next time.